Good day, everybody. Today, I'm going to present on a study on dyslipidemia and total body fat percentages in a group of nursing officers working in teaching hospital on Radhapura. According to the uh, research findings, the stress and sedentary life is associated with dyslipidemia and higher cardiovascular disease risk. So, our objective of the study was uh, to assess the prevalence of dyslipidemia among nurses working in teaching hospital on Radhapura and to assess the correlation between lipid levels and the total body fat percentage. So to achieve these objectives, we conducted a descriptive cross-sectional study recruiting 130 nurses who were apparently healthy. So we, uh, we measured their total body fat percentage using an uh, eight electrode bioimpedance analysis system. And we analyzed their serum lipid levels using enzymatic calorimetry. Uh, then the data were presented as descriptive statistics and correlation. When we move on to our results, the mean age was uh, 39.9 with a standard deviation of nine and their mean total body fat percentage was 35 with the standard deviation of 4.6. Here, uh, you, as you can see, their distribution of total body fat percentages is here. So according to that, more than 50% of the group were in very high total body fat category and 35% were in the high total body fat category and only 12% were in the normal body fat category. So when we consider about the uh, percentage distribution of serum lipids, here you can see uh, around 4.6% of them had high total cholesterol and LDL cholesterol levels. And more than 18% of them had low HDL level. Uh, it means good cholesterol level were low. Based on the uh, low density lipoprotein and high, de high density lipoprotein level ratio, uh, around 21% of them were at risk of cardiovascular diseases. According to the results, their uh, total cholesterol level and LDL cholesterol levels were significantly correlated with their total body fat percentages. So to conclude that uh, our tested population was uh, having 23.8% of dyslipidemia and out of them, more than 85% of were uh, in the very high total body fat percentage category. And the, this total body fat percentage was positively correlated with their uh, total cholesterol and LDL levels. Thank you.